Welcome to Mastering Solutions. In this problem, they tell us that Richard is running late, so he has to drive faster, and they want us to know how many minutes is he saving by going faster. So first, let's write down the equation that we'll, we'll be using, which, as you know, is going to be the velocity equation, which is the change in x or delta x over the change in time. Anything delta is always final minus initial. And in this case, we want to know how much time he's saving, so of course we'll be solving for time. So if we multiply both sides of the equation by delta t, that gives us now delta x is equal to velocity times a change in time. And if we isolate time now, divide both sides by velocity, that gives us the change in time is equal to delta x over the velocity. So now let's figure out how long it takes him if he just goes the speed limit. So normally, if he's going the speed limit, we have delta t is equal to 125 miles. And they tell us that he goes 65 miles per hour. So if we're dividing by a fraction like this, it's the same as multiplying by the reciprocal, which will give us the, the miles will cancel out and it will leave us in hours. So 125 miles divided by 65 miles per hour gives us 1.923. So the time that he goes is 1.923 hours at the speed limit. Now we need to figure out how fast he's going when now we need to figure out how long it takes him when he's going faster. So that will be delta t is equal to the same distance. We didn't change that at all. Divided by a faster speed of 70 miles per hour. That gives us 125 divided by 70. 1.786. One point seven eight six hours. And so now what we're going to do is let's subtract both of those from each other to find the difference. So we have 1.923 hours minus 1.786 hours. 1.923 minus 1.786 gives us 0 0.137 hours. So that is 0 0.137 hours. And now we need to convert this over into minutes for the question. So we know in hours there is 60 minutes. And now the hours will cancel and we're left in minutes. So we have 0.137 times 60 gives us 8.22, or rounded. The book rounds up in this, so I think it was just probably they, they rounded these numbers maybe a little bit differently. But in either case, he saves 8.3 minutes by going 5 miles per hour faster for 125 miles.